Live from Phoenix, Fox 10 News at 9. We've got breaking news on a story we've been telling you about all day. A mother shot and killed after dropping off her child at daycare. And tonight, Sky Fox over the scene where police tell us they have a possible suspect. Rick Krabs joins us live with the story. Well, this is good news, Rick. It is good news, Carrie, and what we're hearing is that they have possibly made an arrest here. Uh, we're waiting. We've got crews that are in route and can give us some more final information, but I do know that they cleared the house here. Uh, you can see the SWAT guys right now are clearing up their equipment and moving back from the scene. That is the house that they were working in right there, and we do hear that they possibly had somebody up in the attic. So, again, this is all tied to that shooting this morning at the church that uh, did kill one lady as he was dropping off her child there at daycare and uh, this is in the Peoria area uh, actually Peoria police are working this it's in the area of Glendale and 75th Avenue in the Northwest Valley you can see a lot of activity still here on the scene and as soon as we get more information guys we'll bring it back to you okay Rick uh, interesting developments in what's been a terrible day all of this happening as we are learning more about the woman who was shot this morning the single mother of three shot in a parking lot at the church daycare center in Peoria near 75th Avenue and Greenway. Miriam Garcia with more on what happened at that church parking lot and the victim. They lost sight of him for maybe a minute, 30 seconds, and he just fell in the pool. A near drowning in Tempe after a two-year-old. Unfortunately, that's the wrong story. We're gonna try to re-rack that story and get you the right one here on that mother who was shot as she dropped her little child off at a daycare. She was shot while she sat in her SUV. We'll have more on that coming up. And there's more breaking news, this time on I-17 near the Glendale exit. All traffic stopped on the southbound lanes because of an accident. And this is what the backup looked like earlier tonight as all of the traffic was being diverted off of I-17. As of now, they're still working on the scene. We're going to keep you updated on this and let you know when it clears up. Charges dismissed against a man who plowed into a minivan, killing a family of four on the Loop 101 in Scottsdale. A judge tossed out a grand jury indictment today against Haluk Candace. Candace slammed into the minivan on the Loop 101 last year, rear-ended it on the off-ramp. The judge says the county attorney's office withheld key information from the grand jury. The grand jury was never told that Candace suffers from epilepsy and that a seizure may have caused him to crash. A man darts out of a Phoenix home yelling and people are that people inside are being held against their will.